So I let Google pick my makeup. And even though I am excited, I'm also nervous. Okay? I am nervous. So let's go ahead and get into this beat. I don't have my, you know, base down. So I'm going to go ahead and run through that pretty quickly. I'm using my Smashbox Primal Water to hydrate, to wake me up, to, you know, bring me back to life. I do have a foundation routine on my channel, so I will link this up here. I'm going to kind of speed through this, really not giving as much detail. So I've been breaking out lately, and I definitely want to try this Ruby Kisses foundation. I used it in my beauty supply store tutorial, and I actually looked and researched the product and it's not supposed to cover your blemishes per se but it's supposed to help your skin get rid of blemishes so i'm going to use that today i'm not putting it all over my face i'm just going to put it where i'm breaking out the most if you watch my channel you already know those areas honey and Yes, and you guys, I am still super duper tired on the day that I look tired. My deep set eyes are out of control. So, um, I'm going to use this LA Girl Pro Concealer in Warm Sand. And you guys, if you haven't watched my fresh makeup tutorial, then I'm going to put an eye card up here because I did a makeup look that is specifically for when you look dead. You know what I'm saying? And I'm going to go into one of my favorite foundations and this is my Becca Radiant Skin Foundation. And so I'm just going to, I'm almost out of this too and it's so sad. And so I'm going to put up a video right here and on the screen you kind of see what I did so I went to Google okay and I've been seeing this you know challenge floating around on YouTube and so I went to Google and I typed in my first letter of my name and the first letter of my last name and I put look behind it and this is what came up I was shook I'm like really what am I going to do with the L, shawty? We're going to make it work today. We're going to make it work. So I'm not going to blend it out all the way. Um, I'm going, well, hold on now. Hold on now. It's the NYX HD Concealer, and this is in the color Cappuccino. And we all know I usually don't do my nose, but today, we do want to know. Don't worry, it looks a little harsh right now. Then we're gonna go back in with that sponge and blend everything out and together. All right, so now I'm going to spray my face with some NYX Max NYX Matte Setting Spray. So I'm going to do my brows after the fact. No, I'm not. I'm lying. I'm not, I'm not gonna put myself through all that turmoil. I'm having one of those days. And I wish I had some brow gel or something. So I'm going to go in with my Cabral, and this is in the number five. And I'm just going to try to use this as quick as I can on my brows because, honey, I do not feel like doing no brows today. I just don't feel like it, but it has to happen. So I'm really going down here already going downhill all right i'm done i'm kidding i don't want to walk around looking like this so now i'm just going to blend out that start this eye look because the anticipation i just can't do it anymore so i'm going to go into my beauty treats modern matte palette and I am going to take this blue here and we are going to run that in the crease but I'm going to just start on the outer corner 
and just build it up. Then I'm going to go in the corner. And I want to be careful with this blue because blue can quickly make you look like you got punched in the face. And ain't nobody get punched in the face over here. Okay. Okay, so now I'm going to take a clean brush and I'm going to start blending out that blue color. I'm not going to put any other product on there. I just want to start blending this out into the crease. And I want this to look somewhat editorial, you know? I want it to look a little bit editorial. So we're going to really blow this color out. Now I'm going to go back into that blue and just build up the outer corner just a little bit more. And this time I'm actually going to blend it up. I'm getting excited I'm getting excited as you guys saw on the screen there is some yellow there's some yellow in the mix okay we all know I really don't have a bomb yellow right now so we're going to try to make it work with what we got okay all right I'm going to go into my Anastasia Beverly Hills contour palette and I'm going to start off with this middle shade which is yellow okay and so I'm going to use that on the center of my lid to start cutting out where I want to place the yellow so I'm just going to place it I already have like a little bit of space there so I'm just going to place it there then I'm going to take my fingers to blend it out this is the infamous yellow okay this is it. I'm not excited. I'm just going to start packing that yellow on. I mean, look, look, I mean, y'all, just look at how powdery it is. Like, what am I supposed to do with that? Look. Like, really? Okay, but we're gonna make it work. I'm gonna start the base. Oh, okay. Yellow. I gotta like. Dig into you 10 times, but you will work. This yellow said, you've been talking about me. I'm going to show up and show out today. Well, you show out, did it? Play ya. Picture, there's like a red line and on the side of the box, and I really want to play off that. So we are going to do that, but let's go ahead and finish the lower lash line. So I'm pretty much going to do the same thing at least I'm going to attempt to do the same thing child look crazy right now Chi but don't worry honey so I'm gonna go ahead and put some mascara on my lower lash line just because it's looking crazy Now it's time for the red and I want to do a red wing liner and so today I'm going to be using something that's out of the ordinary. I'm not going to be using a liner. I'm going to be using a Forever Matte Lippy from Ruby Kisses. So I'm just going to put some of that on the back of my hand. This was a Real Techniques highlighter brush. Ooh. Because I don't really want to cover up the eyes, I'm just going to use mascara on my top lashes.
This is so like mod like, right? Isn't it so like, you know? So for my inner tip, how I am going to be using Orion, and that's this really pretty blue right here. And it is out of the Anastasia Beverly Hills Highlight Aurora Highlight Palette. And so I'm just gonna put that on my inner tear duct. You know, just for a little, a little pizzazz up in there. So definitely giving me pizzazz. Now it's time to really make the skin come alive and wake it up because right now it looks a little bit bland honey it looks a little bit bland okay and i'm we all know i'm using my becca mineral powder and you guys um as i mentioned before i buy these products off of hope look and you know i think the products that they sell on hope look are discontinued for some weird reason so it's either discontinued or they just change the name or they change the way that they you know sell the the actual product because I went on Becca's website and I was looking for you know this powder um, just for like description bar info and stuff like that and y'all they did not have this powder now they had some powders that were similar but it was only like five shades and this powder comes in every single shade that becca makes so i don't know but check hope look out and also follow me on social media um because if i do see that hope look has becca on their site i'll definitely like put out a post or i'll do um something on my insta stories regarding that okay because you don't want to miss it okay because next time they come out, I have to purchase me some more. I just have to. I don't have to tell y'all what highlight I'm using right now. If you know what highlight I'm using right now, okay, I want you to comment below. I'm not even gonna say it. I wanna see who my real, you know, it's not that many of y'all right now. It's really not. But let's see who who is already an OG. Because I want to be even more extra today, I'm going to go on top with another highlighter and I'm going to use this blue highlighter. Why not go wild? Why not why not go crazy, huh? Why not? Alright fam, I really hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. Google picked my makeup and it was a little bit tricky, but I feel as if I did a pretty good job, you know? Also, if you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up and also don't forget to subscribe. I would love for you to join the MDD family. Smooches and I'll see you guys on my next video. Bye!